Hey everyone, today I have a quick tutorial for you. We're gonna be showing you how to add animated text to your photos in Windows 10. It's a free feature in Windows 10 that'll spruce up your photos, giving them life so you can share them with your friends and family. But hey, if you're new here, my name is Ken and this is Northern Viking Every Day. And we bring you videos on reviews and how to's. So please consider subscribing so you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. Let's go ahead and dive right over to my computer and show you how to add animated text to your photos. All right, so here we are on my Windows 10 computer and the program we're gonna be using today is the Microsoft Photos app. It's free and included with Windows 10. You can find it in your start menu in your programs under photos here. You can go ahead and left click on that and open it up. Now the way I like to open the program is actually find the photo that I'd like to edit. So I happen to have one here on my desktop. Now you can search for it on your computer. Maybe it's under your pictures folder. Just go ahead and find the photo. And as long as it's your default app, you can double click on the photo and it should load right into the photos app. Now, if it's not your default app, you can find the photo and you can right click on it, go down to open with right here and select photos right here. You can see I have a whole bunch of different programs um, and I can go ahead and click on photos here and it'll open right up in photos. Now. If all the features I'm showing you today aren't available on your version of the Photos app, you may need to go over to the Microsoft Store and update your Microsoft Photos app here and all the features should appear for you. So once you've got your photo loaded into the Photos app, you can see there's different options here. There's rotate, there's crop, but in the very top right hand corner, you're gonna see an option that says edit and create. Go ahead and left click on that with your mouse. And the option we're looking for today is add animated text right here. You can go ahead and left click on that. That's gonna load up the um, new window for you where you can add text to your photos. So there's a few different options in here. There's text, there's motion, and there's filters. We'll go into motion and filters in just a moment. We're mostly gonna talk about text today. But at the very bottom, you can see there's a timeline now added to your photo from zero seconds to five seconds. So it's kind of created a little mini video for you. Um, with your photo that's five seconds long. There's a little play button here as well that's gonna move this black circle across the screen. Now over on the right here, you can go ahead and type in the text that you'd like on your photo. So maybe we'll type something in. You can see this is at the beach in White Rock, British Columbia. So maybe we'll type in a day at the beach. And you can see it comes up right there in our photo as well. So. There's all sorts of different animated text styles. You can see them here on the right-hand side. Right now, we currently have simple selected. And if I move this little black circle to the left here, it's gonna put it at the beginning. And I can go ahead and hit play here and you're gonna see that text popping up and at the end, it should disappear just like that. Now, one thing I should show you, at the very bottom, we've got the blue bar there now. So these handles will indicate where the text is in your photo. So if you want the text to come up partway through the five seconds, you can move that over just like that. And maybe you want it to go to the end, you can put it right to the end there. I'm gonna have it through the whole photo. So I'm gonna move these all the way to the left and the right, just like that. Now, once we've done that, we can go ahead and I'm gonna move this black thing over so we can see a little bit better. We can see our text. Um, we can go through the different text styles. So you can see we've got simple, we've got loved, we've got joy. Maybe we wanna see what this one looks like. So move that to the beginning, go ahead and hit play. And you can see it pops up there at the bottom, just like that. And it should disappear at the end. So you can go through and have a look at these. Classic adventure. Um, some of them do add filters. So you can see this one has kind of an orange hue to it. If I keep going down here, there's all sorts of them. There's cartoon, there's pixel. Now maybe you're making kind of a retro photo with some video games or something like that. You could have this sort of a look as well um, added to your photo. So just depending on the style you're looking for, there's all sorts of different options. I'm gonna go back up and select joy here at the top, just so it looks like that. Now below that here, you can see there's a layout as well. So you can select where you'd like the text on the screen. So there's the middle, which covers kind of the whole thing. There's the top, there's the left, there's the right, and we already saw the bottom, and then there's a small one in the middle as well. So maybe for this one, I'll select the top so it goes up to the top like that. And again, now when I play this, you'll see it comes in at the top, 
and then it disappears just like that. And it's really that simple to add text to your photo, but I do wanna show you motion and filters as well, because they're gonna add some more life to your photo. So let's go ahead and click on motion here at the top. And this will allow you to have th different things happen to your photo. So you can see you can zoom into center, zoom out of center, zoom into left, zoom into right, etc. And I'll let you play with these. Um, there's some pans in there. But maybe we want our photo to slightly zoom out of the center. I'm going to go ahead and select this one. And I'm going to go ahead and hit play now. And watch what happens. The photo now has some movement to it, making it a little bit more exciting just like that so we can go ahead and do that or maybe let's try one more i'll do um, pan to the right so now when i play it you're going to see the photo is kind of panning to the right creating a cool panned look so you can go ahead and select whichever one you like there i'm going to put mine back on zoom out of center now the other option here at the top is filters if we go ahead and click on filters we can actually change the colors of our photo here as well so um, there's classic adventure pearl um, so adventure again is more of that um, orange look maybe you're looking for the sepia or kind of a black and white look you have all those different options there as well i'm going to leave mine on original today i'll let you play around with that on your own i'm going to go ahead and click back on text here so once we're done and we like our little our little video clip here um, that's five seconds long we can go ahead and click on save a copy down here at the very bottom right hand corner and the highest quality is 1080p i do recommend that there are some lower qualities but i'd recommend 1080p just go ahead and hit on export here and it's going to allow us to pick where we'd like to save our photo you can see it's got the file name um, beach pier it's the same as the photo original photo i'm going to put in beach pier maybe i'll just change the name to one and just so i know which one it is i'm going to select desktop where i'd like to save it you can save it wherever you like and we're just going to hit export here and it's going to export that to our desktop and i'm going to close this here it should be right here on my desktop and i'm just going to go ahead and play that and you can see what it looks like just like that and it's really that simple to add animated text to your photos here in windows 10. So I hope this tutorial was able to help you add animated text to your photos here in Windows 10. If it did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also remember to connect with me on social media. You will find all those links below in the description. Thank you so much for watching today and until next time, take care.